Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Let's learn with the mechanical engineer. So today we are going to design a piston and a connecting rod assembly as you can see it on the screen. So without wasting time, let's just begin with the design. First design the connecting rod part. Okay, so guys, you're supposed to sketch this on the front plane. I have clearly given all the dimensions, just go through it, pause the video and just sketch this thing. After sketching, go to features, extrude, extrude it about the middle plane by a length of 15.875. Okay. After this, just sketch on this face. I'm going to do is so my dimension this thing 33.335 okay I'm just going to take arc think of this thing Dimension this as 9.65 mm. Okay, so this is the design uh, sketch. Now I'm going to extrude this thing. On the opposite side by 15.875 mm only. Okay, I'll just mirror this thing. Want the right plane? Yes. Now sketch on this face. Now dimension this thing as yes. sixty-three point five mm. Trimit of the below part and then only semicircle. Now extrude this thing by 6.35. 6.35. Okay. Again mirror this thing. About the front plane. Okay. Similarly sketch on this face again. Smart dimension this thing. Thirty one point seven five. 31.75 Okay, extrude this thing by 4.4.7625 4 Okay, again mirror this thing about the front plane Okay, now I'll just sketch on this again. Just make a hole, through hole. I mention this thing 22.235. Give an extrude cut through hole. Okay, similarly come over here, sketch over here. Sorry. 
Let's remember the roots of this thing. Now 50.8. So radius it's 25.4. Again extrude cut this thing through all. So more or less uh, this thing is done. Now sketch on this. So guys you're supposed to draw this on this face. Just pause and we'll take the dimension. I'm going to extrude cut this thing by 6.75 mm. Okay, and mirror this thing. Wait, before that, let's just give a fillet. Of 2 mm. Okay. And now I'll just mirror it. Mirror about the front plane. Contact foot and fillet. Okay. So here is the upper part of a connecting rod is ready. Now we'll just design the lower part of the connecting rod. So guys, just save this part as connecting rod upper body. As I've already saved it, I'm not going to save it again. Again, I'll sketch it on the front plane. Six to three point five. Just pull it off the half part in the semicircle. I'm going to extrude this thing about the middle plane. By 28.575. Okay. Now sketch on this part. Dimension this thing. 15.5. Eight seven five and one point five eight eight. Draw central line. Just middle of this thing. Okay. I extrude this thing by 25.4 mm. Reverse the direction. Okay. Okay. Now again, sketch on this face. Take a circle. Now to mention this thing, 9.65. Then I'm going to draw a central line. Mirror on this thing. Oh, this line. Okay. I'll just extrude cut this thing through all. Okay. Sketch on this face. Smart dimension this thing. Fifty point eight. Four line. of the necessary part and just extrude cut this thing through all again so here is your part almost ready 
just save this part as connecting rod below part okay that's enough for piston just draw the sketch on the front plane i have clearly given all the dimensions just draw this thing the sketch and after this just revolve this thing okay so this is what you will get now just sketch it on the front plane take a square tangle yes i'll dimension this thing all right just draw this on the front plane and now i'm going to extrude revolve cut this thing to find to draw the spacing for piston rings as you can see it on the screen i'm going to pattern this thing just make a temporary axis of 3 at a distance of 6.35 again reverse direction okay so this is not going to look like now go to front plane just click on the front plane reference geometry plane now with reference to front plane i'm going to give another planar distance of 13.2 mm okay i just sketch it on this plane so i'll dimension this thing by 28.575 just extrude this thing up to surface okay wait i'll just give the original dimension first the horizontal dimension is 44.45 Okay. Now just go to features, extrude, extrude up to the surface to next. Okay. okay. Now just go to mirror, mirror it about the right plane. Okay. Okay. Now just again sketch it on the front plane. the pattern will be there just take a circle dimension this thing by 22.23 at a vertical distance from the base 44.45 now extrude this thing extrude cut about the mid plane Should be through to increase the dimension as much possible. Okay, so this is not going to look like. I just give it a fillet to it. Let's fill it with this tool. Five mm. Make it four. It's too large five. Okay. I can give a fillet. Yeah. And the side. by 2 mm okay so the piston is ready now now let's just begin with the assembly part now just go to assembly click on okay first thing i am going to browse is the connecting rod upper part okay i place it over here secondly again i'll insert the component lower part of connecting rod now 
I'm going to do is mate mate this one and this one okay again mate this thing and this just reverse it yes okay now mate this surface and this surface okay so we are done with this mate now get the piston the assembly part is easy you can do it by yourself piston head now what i am going to do is mate this face and this thing i just made it okay now again this surface and this one i'll make it okay so here is your piston cylinder assembly ready so guys if you like my video please 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 subscribe my channel over here thank you very much for watching my video thank you